How different would this world be if all of us ladies devoured our mates after breeding? Would it be a better place? I don't know. Tonight we're talking about the Southern Black Widow or Lactrodectus mactans. So of course you're thinking to yourself, this deadly tarantula girl, would she have black widows? Of course I do. A couple of widows that I uh, harvested myself while we were out um, hunting and, you know, looking around the terrain. Uh, this species is common in most of North America. And so all of you uh, viewers watching in the U.S., you've probably got widows all around you. So, this spider is famous for two things. Their deadly bite, which um, is not always fatal to humans, but can be. So I'm handling this animal with care and do not advise anyone to play with this spider. We actually collect this species um, for buyers that harvest venom and do studies at universities and uh, sometimes they wind up on movie sets and things like that. But um, So they're known for their coloration, their jet black bodies and their red hourglass marking on their abdomen. So you can see as she climbs up this web. Um, the other thing is for killing their mates. Now, the black widows do not always kill their mates, but it happens. And just for your information, if you see this spider, you are looking at a female. The males do not look like this. So um, this is actually a docile species that will retreat if threatened. They typically only bite if they feel their life is threatened. So not a bad animal, beautiful creature, and um, actually a really good source of insect control. So um, you got to see the Black Widow tonight from the Deadly Tarantula Girl. Hope you liked it and I'll see you next time.